Hello everybody, I am Moldy West and this is Torchlight 2 once again. In this episode, we're gonna complete, or at least try to complete, the genie's final task of stealing his rival's lamp of marbles. It is a lamp filled with marbles. Them marbles must be real valuable if you want me to go around here stealing it. So, what's exactly in this direction? Doesn't look like anything other than weird, dark wind. Oh, netherlings. Haven't seen any of those guys in a while. That just makes me a lot happier to destroy them. And I am starting to feel like I am way under leveled for this place because I am taking a lot more damage than I'm supposed that I can take a lot of damage. They do a lot of damage. And I'm pretty sure it said the recommended level was like 35 or something. And I am level 24. Well, that explains a lot, actually. No matter. I will push on and crush these higher level enemies despite my low levelness. Because I am invincible! I am unstoppable! Nothing can stand before me! Not even this nether shade! Because he sucks and he's ugly and nobody likes him. He is clumsy and stupid! And ugly? How ugly must you be to be so ugly that you are so goddamn stupid with all of the ugliness? There you go, tentacle! You ain't gonna be a tentacle anymore when I'm done with you. Get up on out of here, Nella Jade, you ain't welcome here. None y'alls is welcome here, even though this is your home and I've marched in there. I feel like I used this joke before. Yeah! I just love repeating myself. Those is some big tentacles. Okay, and they want to kill me. That's just great. I don't know what that shocky orb is, but I should probably avoid it. Oh look, more tentacles! Something that I can kill, and destroy, and crush, and maim, all for the sake of gaining my own benefits and stuff. And that'll do. Lots of dead tentacles round here. And all these nether things. Yes. Y'all gonna get destroyed now. All of ya. The death comes for you. You do. You get the dead too. Hurry up and get dead. There. Y'all is dead. And why are yet more tentacles appearing from nothing? Popping up out of the ground all nasty like that. That's gross. And you're dumb and ugly. It's what you get from being tentacles. I just don't like them tentacles. They're all wiggly and gross. And I think I've run it out of things to say. But it ain't gonna stop me from whipping nether thingy ass. Oh look, Grave Scratcher. Why do you go scratching graves? You can't do that, that is disrespectful. And these bastards drained all my blue stuff. How dare they? I was trying to hit this guy with my breezy breath, but I couldn't do it because the bastard drained off the man! Get out of here, Grave Scratcher, nobody likes you. Not here. Why not here? Not here. I want to open a goddamn waypoint portal and go back to town and sell all my garbage, but no! I can't do that here! I get to just die, apparently! You have perished. Yes, I've perished. Now send me back to the entrance so I can go and just go back to town and do things that I want to do in town. Eh. Time for revenge. You ain't gonna give me this time, you nasty-ass tentacles. 
Not today! Not ever again! You're gonna get your asses whipped, and do tentacles even have asses? Well, they should. There's gotta be some way to fuck it. And by fuck it, I mean kill! Of course, you can kill most anything if you just hit it hard enough. Things don't usually survive being hit real hard. If it does bleed, we can't kill it. That'd be the lesson you need to learn here. That's right, you son of a bitch. Y'all getting dead. Dead for all. And I know that those weren't the tentacles that killed me because the tentacles that killed me were over that way and I'm going this way now because there might be something different. Like more tentacles! And more things that want me dead that deal too much damage. Get out of here, you fucking nether like an asshole. Too many, too many at once. Your too much damage. Fled. There. Let's funnel them in here like this. There. Now we can thin out the numbers. That is an effective strategy. If there's too many at once, just run away, let them follow, and then kill them off one at a time until there are none left. There. Now, you're gonna... Oh, there's another one. Y'all gonna get it, Nethershade. There. Now it's tentacle time! All them tentacles gonna die now, because I got my frenzy thing up. Oh, it's gone. Frenzy thingy ran out right when I needed it most to kill more tentacles. Dip tentacles out again more. I never liked you, so I took back all the liking I gave you, so fuck you. And a goddamn mimic. Why couldn't it just be a regular ass chest? That is annoying, and this thing's ugly. Fucking netherling, send you right back to the nether. For a moment there, I was down inside the ground. And I really wish Mr. Narrator would quit saying that my pet is wounded. My pet has fled. I know. I am fully aware of my pet situation, Narrator. I don't need to hear your nonsense! And now I take revenge upon these tentacles, the ones that killed me before! You will never kill again, because it is you who shall now be killed! Yeah, dead tentacles ain't gonna bother me ever again! Nobody gonna bother me ever again because I'm gonna shut myself away and go live in the mountains all alone for the rest of my life. Take that, society! Eh. Maybe they'll run out of netherlings if I keep on killing them. That is sound logic, isn't it? The kind of logic that'll win wars. They will eventually run out of troops to send at me! There we go! That's a whole lot of tentacle right there. Get out of here, Featherling, you're ugly and stupid. And all these tentacles, too, they too shall fall. Fall, damn ya! All y'all tentacles gonna get cut! Yeah! Now give me that chest. Don't you bitch slap me, you big ass tentacle bitch. There. Now, oh, for the love of fuck. More nether shades. These are the guys that do a lot of damage when they swarm all over me. And now I am here wondering. Why do they expect me to be such a higher level than I am for this place? Do they expect me to just relentlessly grind enemies and search for every quest I can find? Because apparently that seems to be the case! This game doesn't seem to be paced very well in terms of leveling up and shit! I must kill all the tentacles I see. 
I must get all the experience I can, apparently, because the game wants me to be a much higher level than I already am. That makes sense. Hey! Yay! I leveled up! Now let's see about them skills and shit. Shred armor. Yeah, that good. And other stuff. Let's beef up my strength. I wanna get super beefy! The beefier I am, the better. That'll allow me to completely destroy my enemies! And hopefully that big ass tentacle learns how to not be such a rude slappy bitch! Yeah, look at that! Doing so much more damage now! And it may have something to do with that strength buff, or maybe that shred armor thing I just picked up. That seems to be real good. Look at all that damage, all that critical happening there. There will be no more nether shade that will be able to stand against me. There will be no more anything that will be able to stand against me, especially no goddamn nether shade. But they still do damage. I believe I am what you would call a glass cannon. <laughs> I hit like a truck, but I am easily broken. <laughs> God damn me and my weak defenses. I'll just cut my way through all these bastards. Yeah. Now let's go in there. Steal that lap of marbles, and I'm probably gonna have to fight whatever the genie's rival's name was. Probably. Let's go a kick of him ass. Oh, there he is. Frosty Breath! Damn. Ezrek Khan. Ah, I see. You're just gonna summon friends to fight for you. I can deal with this. I know what it takes to wreck some ass cheeks. And your ass cheeks will be thoroughly wrecked, Ezrek Khan. And after I steal your lap of marbles, then you're gonna wish you had fucked with me! Where's the- oh, there it is. Cinderblade! Die! You stupid! There. You died. Where you going, fatty? Ah, you step into the ring yourself. That's nice. It is always a good thing. Fun time when the true bad guy jumps into battle. And I'm just gonna sit here and chug health potions and wail on you till you die. That is my strategy, and I'm sticking to it! Now die, you ugly son bitch! And don't you go teleporting away from me. At least he doesn't have a shit ton of health like them other bosses did. He's losing health at a decent pace. Now I'm gonna get you, and I can just keep on healing. I'm the sort of thing you can't de defeat. A guy with nothing better to do with his time. Yeah, Ezrek Khan. I'm gonna con your Ezrek. Why is that like my go-to taunt? To you? Incorporate their name and use it as like an insult. I don't even know. All I do know is that I am incredibly stupid and dumb and ugly and nobody likes me! But I do know that this guy's getting his ass whipped. He keeps on shooting me with them finger guns, but it ain't gonna do nothing because I am regenerative boy! Fall, Ezric Khan. Oh. You have not yet fallen. This is going to be annoying, isn't it? Oh, look who's back. So, let's do this again. Except this time it actually beats you. Did you just teleport me? Oh, summoning duplicates, are you? Well, I'll just have to destroy that. Destroy the duplicate, then I'll go destroy you. 
That's right. As wrecked Connor, please stop teleporting me. You can teleport yourself, just not me. Okay, so you can teleport me if you're gonna have a bad time. Quit with that finger gun. That's just annoying. You're annoying, you fat ass genie. Oh, damn you and your teleporties. But it doesn't matter. I'm still gonna get you! Unless this is like rule of three or something where I have to beat you up three times like this. Then I might get a little frustrated. Frustration is the name of the game. So. I'm gonna kill ya. You're going to get your ass whipped. And I would very much be happy if you'd stop teleporting me. There, you have fallen again. So is that the end of it? Nope. Fucking. Rule of threes! God damn it! Hey, you ain't supposed to be coming back out while you still got eh, like ads out here. That's just rude! Fuck you, Ezra Khan! I'm gonna fuck you real good and not in the way that you like! I'm gonna fuck you in a bad way, brother! That's what I talking about, and eventually you will be destroyed, and that is what I'll make me happy, get rid of at least one of you, there, maybe he won't summon two of them if there's only, he's still got one, that seems like a good strategy, just cut him ads in half. Then, oh, he just went free summon. God damn it. God damn it, Ezric Khan. I really wish you weren't such a big swing and dick summon friends like that. But perhaps it is what will make me stronger in the end. You do realize that what does not kill me makes me stronger. So as long as you do not kill me, I will indeed become more powerful! More powerful than even you, you genie-ass son of a bitch! And crazy crap! Now I'm out of healing potions! I bet you're happy! Well, shit! He done went kill me. Nothing that reviving and then going straight back in can't fix. Now, there he is. Just, I'll just keep on throwing my corpse at you until you die. That's my strategy. That's not him. That one is. You have died. I will die as many times as I have to as long as you die with me. I don't care how much gold I lose on these resurrections. I will rise again and again, and you will fall! Yeah, Ezrek Khan, and finger guns, which I can actually dodge because, oh, you fucking cunt. Don't you go teleport me. And I really wish you'd quit summoning your mirror images and killing me so often. I will regain my losses. Don't you worry about that, Connie boy. Damn it. Which one's the real one? That one is. That's the real one. That's the real one. And I can kill you eventually. Ow. I'm dead. He is super close to dying. I, I'll get you. Just you wait. There we go. Ezrek Khan is dead and so am I. But it doesn't matter. I still got him. 
I'll just take all your stuff, your mysterious pants. Of course, the greatest pants of all. Uh, you are, oh, you're not Ezra Khan. Everything has transpired exactly as I intended. I have my lamp of morals. At last, I am free. Uh, okay. I confess, this lamp is much more valuable than you who have known. This red card stole it from me ages mm. ago. And now that I have them both, I have my freedom and ultimate power all my own as well. Okay. That's for your guard. Defeating Ezra Khan has sufficiently weakened the magic they bound her. You should be able to confront her now. I have honored my bargain. Sweet. I'll just take this sword and I'll be on my way. Thank you. Now, let's see if I can actually use that sword. Yep, I got good enough strength for it. Hell yeah! And that looks nothing like the picture I got. That's a fucking scimitar and that the picture's like a lightning-shaped blade. Yeah, look at that sword. That is not the sword that was advertised. I call shenanigans! But anyway, that's gonna do it for this episode, because I'm all out of time for it, so thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching, and I hope to see you again in the next one. Goodbye!